We have thousands of fish coming up dead in the Indian River Lagoon again, and Brevard County officials are saying that they think the warmer weather and algae booms are to blame. Now, if that's the case, there should be evidence showing that that is the case. As of right now, that is just the statement. And we've seen a lot of these fish kills before in different areas from different reasons and a lot of times from algae booms. We'll see a lack of oxygen in the water that causes this. And it will affect many different types of animals and, and fish. Other times, it's more than that. Other times, it's not an algae boom whatsoever. It ends up being something from, say, a chemical, something in the water, something else affecting them. And as of right now, there's very little detail as to what exactly is going on. Although this isn't the first time it's happened in the region. But we've been seeing a lot more of this. We've been seeing a lot of strange activity in terms of animals washing up on the shore. I just did a story in the UK, the beaches over there, where stuff was washing up on the shore ankle deep. Starfish, all kinds of other stuff. I mean, you name it was washed up and I tried to say there that the weather had shifted three degrees and that a storm coming through killed everything sucked everything up off the ocean floor and just dumped everything on the coastline that's what they were saying there nonetheless lots of animals died in that instance and in this one we have another massive fish kill but I like to keep track of these things we also witnessed a bunch of birds that were taken out here recently uh, in a city, I believe it was Mexico City. Like they just hit a wall in the air, all in the same area, on the same street. And to add that to uh, all the rest of this, and that is what has happened here as of late within the past few weeks. But I will leave a link. I will continue to update. If you guys got anything you want me to report on, let me know, dabu7yahoo.com. And a shout out to everyone out there that helps share all this information. It is appreciated to the fullest, especially in these days and times. But what's going on out here on these platforms? I've never seen it like this. It's at an all-time high. It's just crazy. Much love, y'all.